Alert, media covering up Hillary's direct link to Trump Jr. meeting. Democrat fingerprints are all over the meeting between Donald Trump Jr. and a Russian lawyer, indicating that it may have been a setup. The New York Times reported that Renat Akhmachin and Anatoly Samakornov were both present during the June 2016 meeting between Russian lawyer Natalia Veselnitskaya and members of the Trump presidential campaign, via Briet Bart. However, the failing New York Times refused to elaborate on the translator, Anatoly Samakornov, who was employed by the State Department while Hillary Clinton was Secretary of State. The New York Times and other liberal publications following their lead are desperately trying to cover up Hillary Clinton's connection to the now infamous meeting. Last June, Donald Trump Jr. agreed to meet with Natalia Veselnitskaya in the heat of the presidential election. The Russian lawyer claimed to have opposition research information on Hillary Clinton. quickly learned that the dirt on Clinton was a ploy used to get his attention. The real purpose of the meeting was to lobby the potential president's son over Russian sanctions. While the meeting was ultimately feckless, the mainstream media considers this the smoking gun that proves the Russian conspiracy theory they have been pushing for months. Both Donald Trump Jr. and the Russian lawyer believe the meeting was a result of miscommunication. Veselnitskaya asked Aries Agalarov to set up the meeting. Aries worked with Donald Trump on the 2013 Ms. Universe pageant in Russia. His son, Amir, is a famous Russian pop singer represented by publicist Trop Goldstone. Goldstone ultimately set up the meeting. He is an American and an acquaintance of Donald Trump Jr. Veselnitskaya claims she was told Donald Trump Jr. wanted to discuss sanctions and was surprised that they were not on the same page. He said the intermediaries probably goosed up and in the end, there was probably some bait and switch about what, the meeting, was really supposed to be about. While the meeting amounted to nothing. The media spun it as proof of Donald Trump's corruption. However, the State Department's hands are all over this meeting, indicating that it may have been a bigger bait and switch than even Trump Jr. realizes. Do you think this meeting was set up by Democrats? Please share the story on Facebook and tell us what you think because we want to hear your voice.